Hey, what's going on guys? It's Tom Mason here and today I'm starting a new section on my channel called Behind the Image where I'm going to show you one of my shots and talk you through how I took it, the process behind it to give you a bit of inspiration and some tips and tricks for your own shooting. So this shot I took about five years ago in September whilst all of my friends had just gone off to university, freshers week, they were all getting drunk, going to parties, stuff like that. And I was stood every morning, five, six o'clock in the morning in Richmond Park, waiting for the sun to come up to photograph the deer. And to be honest, I wouldn't have changed it for the world. It's absolutely where I wanted to be. Um, and I had a huge amount of fun in those first couple of weeks when I was really starting uh, to develop and, and really push myself to, to forge a career as a wildlife photographer. Now at the time I was just trying to create one picture of deer that was a bit different to some of the others I'd seen. I'd seen loads of stuff of you know beautiful misty mornings with a deer standing out and they're great, they're lovely, they're really beautiful pictures and to be honest I've never really got that great a shot myself of that. So I was just going for something different and wandering through, I really enjoyed looking at the deer in the forest. I loved the way that I would see their silhouettes move through the trees and that's what I decided I'd go and capture. So every morning I would follow, um, try and follow a small group of deer into the forest and a lot of the time I'd find them as the hinds would be following a male and a, and a stag through the forest uh, and eventually I found a few positions that I knew I would see deer moving through every day and in those shots I would just work out where the light would come up so I could get the shot that I was finally after that is the one behind me. Now the process of getting the shot is firstly everything has to be silhouette bar the beautiful lighting. Um, the light I expose for by spot metering, spot metering straight into the middle to get my exposure right. Exposed for that everything else is going to be plunged into silhouette absolutely perfect for what I want and then it's all about waiting and timing. You know getting the timing right so that all the heads are just outside of the trees, just poking out, um, so you can see their silhouette is the key. Um, and again, repetition is a really important thing here. Uh, I did it on many mornings, going up to the same spots and just waiting and trying to get this shot. Um, and on this day, you know, everything just came together. The beautiful light, the, you know, the deer all walking in a line, three hinds and a male stag on the end, absolutely perfect. And then also finding that my trees had to work nicely. I've got one, two, three, four, five key pillars. You know, they break up the composition a bit and just make it that little bit more interesting. And that's what I'm always looking for when I'm shooting shots. So that's it for this quick behind the image. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you like the shot. Have you got any thoughts on it? You know, do you like this kind of shot or would you like to see more detail? Drop them in the comments below. Um, and if you've got any questions about wildlife photography, drop them down there too. More than happy to get back to you. Uh, and join me again soon for more wildlife photography content on this channel um, and remember to like and subscribe to keep up to date with everything and join me again soon.